Hi, this is Rudy Bowles. I'm the product director for Eagle. This is a 321 RSTS, a model 25. We're going to go over some of the new features that we added for 25. Uh, first feature is the blue sink. Uh, this is a exterior entertainment. We wanted to have uh, a separate entertainment on the outside as well as inside. So what this system is, it's a simple system. It's a two button, uh, one that pairs up your Bluetooth phone. We upgraded the speakers or MB Quart speakers. Um, so the sound is a lot better than what we had in the previous years. Uh, the other button, we actually include an HDMI cable. So you can hook up an exterior TV and then the other button on there, it switches right over to the TV. So it goes from Bluetooth to TV. Uh, the HDMI, that is something that's new this year. So now you can have full on outside entertainment. The second thing is uh, the leveling controls, which is on the off door side. We kind of took it, we used to have it in the pass through storage there. Uh, but you kind of had to crawl in there and get to it. So now we're putting an LP door. Open the LP door up on the off door side and the switch controls are right there. The third thing we have is the Nuvo. This is an H2O system. It's a whole house filter system. So you have three canisters. Filters are included. Uh, we do this for all Eagle. So uh, the first filter is hard particulates. The second filter is more fine particulates. And then the white filter there is uh, it's called citrus technology. So what that does is it basically water softens all of your water. So no matter if you're at a campground and you're plugging in to get the campground water or you're dry camping and your full tank is full, it will always run through the filter system. So your washer dryer water is filtered, your shower water, stool, sink, dishes, drinking water, 100%. Um, it reduces scale buildup. Uh, you won't see rust on uh, certain spots if you get some bad water. So it's a pretty slick system. It's exclusive to us. Uh, we're the only ones using it right now. Um, the next system is the dump light, which is also on the off door side. Um, we thought it was a good idea to put a nice amber light where your dump station is. So that is, uh, if you have floor plans that have multiple tanks, you will have multiple lights there. The switch is in your utility area where all your water connections are. Flip the switch, it illuminates the whole ground so you can see everything you're doing at night. Uh, the, uh, the other system that we have is the Halo Griddle. Uh, this is a new griddle system that we just uh, came out with. So we were using Capital past couple years. We switched to the Halo Griddle here. Um, CNET rated this the uh, 2024 best griddle for camping. Uh, we love it for many different features. One, it has a lid, it didn't have a lid last time. The other nice thing is this griddle actually sits in the housing. So you don't have wind, you don't need windshields or anything like that. It's a two burner system. It has rubber legs, so if it's sitting on the J-Port table, it's not gonna slide around. Uh, the Capital Griddle did that a little bit, so that was another feature that we loved. Um, it's also adjustable, it comes with a level, simple things like that. Um, but we've been using this for the past few months, kind of demoing it, and we're seeing uh, nothing but great things with it. Um, the last thing that I saw on here, well, WineGuard uh, 5G, we switched to uh, a 5G, we were a 4G, so we switched that uh, technology and the amount of people that uh, work full time in their campers these days at campgrounds, it's ever important to keep up with technology. So you have a 5G uh, antenna up there as well. The last thing is on your rear wall, we changed the tail light. Uh, no more than we kind of got tired of looking at the same rear light. So we added a uh, bigger, longer, it's more updated. Um, it actually illuminates better, a lot brighter when you hit the brake lights. So we added that in there as well. And those are the exterior features for 2025 Eagle. So now we're on the inside of the 321 RSTS. This is one of our more popular floor plan has been for a lot of years. We did a little bit of redesigning to it. Um, what we did is uh, we took the pantry out of the slide out and we incorporated it over there with a breakfast nook. We didn't have the breakfast nook before. In doing that gives me all sorts of extra room. I have left and right side uh, cooking area to work with. We also tripled the size of the window that we had in the slide out there so it lets a lot of natural light in. So um, we're, we're feeling that that's going to be some monster changes for this particular floor plan here. Um, some of the features that we added for 2025, uh, the sink, um, the ever argument of either I have a split sink or I have an all-in-one sink. We found a sink that does everything for everybody. Um, this has a lot of features. It has a lot of extra uh, uh, vegetable cleaner. Um, you have water that shoots here. That's what this knob is for. So you go left, you get a rainfall water effect. You go right, you get your pull-out sprayer. Um, you push down here, you have glass cleaner. So push down, water sprays up, cleans the glasses. You still have your wood shop block. 
You have extra bin in here. This all stuff slides, it takes out, it removes. So if you have crock pots, uh, Dutch ovens, anything like that, you need to do some hard cleaning in there. You've got plenty of space for it. Um, you do have the soap dispenser. Uh, you can fill it from the top, not from the bottom. And then this little knob here closes and opens your drain at the bottom. So if you have dirty water, you don't want to put your hands in there. Just turn it open, water drains out. So uh, literally, uh, this thing uh, can do just about everything. Um, another feature that we added was the same as I talked about outside. We have an inside entertainment as well. The simple system, the blue sink. So you got two buttons. The Bluetooth still pairs your phone. These are all smart TV, so it will pair to your... Uh, your phone or your TV via Bluetooth as well, or you simply push the TV button and it turns on as well. So it's simple system, no app, no nothing, works great. Uh, we actually upgraded the speakers to MB Quartz speakers. You have an A and B selector switch in here. So A is your left and right speaker inside the living room and kitchen. We put a uh, speaker in the bathroom and we also put a speaker in the bedroom. We had a lot of feedback uh, customers wanted music in the bathroom, so we accommodated that and put one in there. So if you don't want that, of course, just press the B button and it disconnects that. But if you want music all the way throughout, you can activate all of it. Another feature we did was all fabric furniture. Uh, we've been doing a lot of homework on this. Uh, the industry has been using vinyl for many, many years. And uh, we identified that 93% of customers that replace their RV furniture replace it to cloth furniture. So we thought there might be something there. So we found a furniture that's super comfortable, uh, very, very pet friendly. It has a 50,000 double, double wear count is what they call it. Um, so it's very, very uh, durable, hot, cold tested. Uh, it's not gonna fade, it's not gonna crack, it's not gonna peel, it's not gonna do any of that stuff. And for somebody that's been sitting on vinyl for a lot of years at RV shows, it is very refreshing sitting on cloth furniture. So I'm super excited, all of us are. I believe we're doing that across the board company wide. So super excited. So your sofa is gonna be that way, your theater seat's gonna be that way uh, across the board. Another feature is uh, something that a lot of customers have been asking for for many years. We were very reluctant in doing that because the way others were doing it seemed inefficient uh, from our R&D testing. So what we're doing now is uh, no registers in the floor, no registers throughout. All your registers are going to be toe kicks or they're going to be in the wall, built into the wall. So nothing in the floor, no pet, uh, no pet hair, no debris, no nothing. That's been uh, uh, the difficulty. Uh, throughout the years. So we were able to keep all the ducting exactly the same way as we, we were in the past. So we're still as efficient as we always have been. We just redirected all of our uh, all of our registers. So that's a big feature. Customers should love that because uh, they have been at us for a few years to do that. So another feature is all of our chairs now are going to be foldable. Uh, they are a little bit bigger, a little bit more plush than they were before. We had wooden chairs before. These are all metal based, but they're all adjustable. They all fold down. They can all store away. They will come with four on Eagle fifth wheels. So you'll have two more that uh, you can either store under the bed or store into the closet. So um, pretty excited about that. We're continuing with the piv pivotable table. Whether you have an office, uh, you want to seat four, two, uh, you want to put dog kennels uh, in between there, which seems to be pretty common. So it's very efficient. You can use it for a lot of different things. Uh, that is the living room kitchen. Next, we'll go up into the bedroom and the bathroom. So a couple 2025 uh, tweaks that we made to the bathroom. Um, the first thing is we didn't have a drawer anywhere. We didn't want to kick this off to the center, so we wanted to make sure we had plenty of space in there. So we added a drawer below just for extra odds and ends. Uh, the other thing was the shower door is new. Um, it has a new latch to it, so you don't have to forget or remember if you flip the latch in transit, or even us in manufacturing, for instance, but if you push it, it automatically locks in. The other thing we add is a, a shower teak seat prep. So there's a backer, there's a sticker right there in the wall if anybody decides or they want more uh, seating or a seat in there, they can uh, mount the seat. So the last couple items in the bedroom that we tweaked is uh, the entrance way. So we took out the door jam here and put a pocket door. So now I am I'm able to make it a lot more open than it was before, a little more inviting into the bedroom. The other thing is we deepened all the slides on all of our bedrooms. So now I have gonna, I'm gonna have a lot more walkway than I did before. A lot easier to get to the washer on one side, dryer on the other. So just a lot more access that we didn't have before. 
Last thing I'll point out is, like I said before, we did add a bedroom speaker. So your system in the living room, your B speaker, will actually put out the sound uh, into bedroom as well. Thank you for watching. This is the 321 RSTS. If you want to see more information, 360 views, pictures, uh, standards, options, anything like that, please visit Jayco.com.